So in this problem, we have been given two numbers. The first number is 2 raised to the power 31 and the second number is 3 raised to the power 21. We have to find which number is greater. Now if you look to the base of number, in one case base is 2 and in another case base is 3. So bases are different. What about, ex what about exponents? Now in this case exponent is 31 and in this case exponent is 21. So exponent is also different. So how we can compare? So we have to make exponent equal, then only we can compare. Now how we can make the exponent equal? Now you see in this case we have 1 and in this case also we have 1. So this means we can rewrite and we may have some matching pattern. So let us try to rewrite or re-express these numbers. So the first number is 2 raised to the power 31. Now 31 we can write 30 plus 1. And now if you remember rules of power, if we have some number a raised to the power m plus n, then this can be written as a raised to the power m multiplied by a raised to the power n. Same situation in this problem a is equals to 2. So what we have? We have a which is 2 and m which is 30, n which is 1. This means I can rewrite this expression as 2 raised to the power 30 plus 1, uh, 30 multiplied by 2. 2 raised to the power 1, basically that is 2. Now, we are still want to simplify because even if I do the same thing for this number, that is 2 raised to the power uh, 3 raised to the power 21 for this number if I do the same steps what will happen we will have 3 raised to the power 20 plus 1 this will be 3 raised to the power 20 multiplied by 3 raised to the power 1 so still the exponent is not same exponent is 30 and here I have exponent 20 So we need to do further simplification. So I will use another rules of power that is if you have a raised to the power m. So this will be a raised to the power m and raised to the power n. This can be written as a raised to the power m times n. So this is again a different rule of power. So this is n here. Now I will use this rule. So see 30 can be written as 3 into 10 and this is 2 here. So this means m into n is 3 into 10. So now I can write 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 10 because I can use this expression and this multiplied by 2. Now if I do the same steps for this expression, what we will have? We will have 3 raised to the power 2 times 10 multiplied by 3 and this can be written as 3 raised to the power 2 and this raised to the power 10 multiplied by 3. Now we have very important thing that is exponents are now equal. Here I have exponent 10 and here also I have exponent 10. So now I can do something. So let us take ratio. Generally whenever we have to compare, ratio is a good thing. So let us take ratio. So we will consider ratio of 2 raised to the power 31 divided by 3 raised to the power 21. And as I showed earlier, this can be written as this term 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 10 into 2 and this divided by 3 square 
raised to the power 10 so this is multiplied by 3 now we can rewrite 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 10 divided by 3 square raised to the power 10 multiplied by 2 by 3. Now see this we have another rule of exponent and this rule is if you have a raised to the power m divided by b raised to the power m then this can be written as a by b raised to the power m. So if I use this rule we can write 2 raised to the power 3 basically that is 8 and 3 by 3 square is 9 so 8 by 9 raised to the power 10 multiplied by 2 by 3. So now what can you say about this number? So this number. So now if you see this ratio this number is less than 1. Why? Because 8 by 9 is less than 1 and 2 by 3 is also less than 1. So if you take power 10 then this will be less than 1 even lesser than 1 this becomes a smaller because if you have a smaller number and you are taking power so this is becoming a smaller and a smaller and you are multiplying by 2 by 3 so this number is less than 1. So now I can say this ratio that is 2 raised to the power 31 divided by 3 raised to the power 21 is less than 1. This means what? 2 raised to the power 31 is less than 3 raised to the power 21. So this means 3 raised to the power 21 is a bigger number. So 3 raised to the power 21 in this case is a greater number. So this number is a greater number. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you like this video please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.